Mel B has shared the touching moment she visited her late father's grave to tell him she had been awarded an MBE in the New Year Honors list. The singer, who is being rewarded for her services to domestic violence victims, explained she had told her father on his deathbed that she would leave her abusive marriage and said he would be so proud that she has been recognized for her charity work. Martin Brown passed away in March 2017 aged 63 following a battle with myeloma cancer. Just two weeks later, Mel split from husband Stephen Belafonte and later claimed she had suffered abuse, allegations Stephen has repeatedly denied. In an Instagram post on Tuesday, the Spice Girl, 43, shared a black and white image visiting her father's grave in Leeds. Alongside she wrote, This was the moment I told my dad about my MBE. On his deathbed I promised him I would leave my abusive marriage. He gave me that strength. He would be so proud. I'm overwhelmed honored and grateful and as patron of it women's underscore aid I will never stop this fight to hashtag stop abuse hashtag it's no tie or fault hashtag silence and more hashtag women support women hashtag speak up hashtag you are a note alone hashtag reclaim these streets hashtag your life matters hashtag together we're a stronger. The post comes after Mel revealed she has dedicated her MBE for her work with domestic violence charity Women's Aid to other people who suffered in abusive relationships. The singer was named in the New Year Honors for services to charitable causes and vulnerable women, and she declared, This, for me, was all about them. Mel said receiving the accolade made her incredibly proud as she remembered all the women she had met during her work and to her late father. Speaking to the son about learning she had received the honor, she said, I thought about all the women I've met over the past few years who have been through terrible situations, women who have died, women who are still suffering. This, for me, was all about them. It still is. She continued, receiving that letter telling me about the MBE. It was the first time I thought that it done something. Not as a Spice Girl, but as Melanie Brown, this working class, mixed race kid from Leeds who has always done her own thing, regardless. That made me feel incredibly proud of myself of all women who've been through similar experiences and of all the people who have helped me along this path. Earlier this year, the singer starred in a short film exploring domestic violence through dance. The video, which was directed by and featured the music of composer Fabio D'Andrea, saw her recreating a woman's escape from an abusive relationship and was inspired by the stories she heard while a women's aid patron. The dance was choreographed by Ashley Wallen, who has worked with stars including Kylie Minogue and Mariah Carey, and on The Greatest Showman film starring Hugh Jackman. Melanie split from her film producer ex-husband Stephen in 2017 after a decade. She claimed in her 2018 memoir Brutally Honest that she had suffered abuse, allegations Belafonte has repeatedly denied. Mel's father Martin died from cancer following an eight-year illness in 2017. Pop star Mel said that, apart from the women who have suffered, she wanted to dedicate her award to her father. She said he started the journey I will be on for the rest of my life, working as much as possible to raise awareness for domestic abuse. The star, originally from Leeds, won five Brit Awards and scored nine UK number one singles alongside her fellow Spice Girls, Victoria Beckham, Emma Bunton, Melanie Chisholm, and Jerry Horner. After the group went on hiatus in 2000, she established herself as a TV personality and talent show judge, with appearances on The X Factor, Celebrity Juice, and America's Got Talent. 
the girl group reunited in 2019 for a stadium tour of the UK and Ireland, although Victoria did not join her former bandmates. Mel is the second Spice Girl whose services have been celebrated through the British Honours System. Victoria was made an OBE by the Duke of Cambridge in April 2017 in recognition of her 17-year career as a fashion designer outside of the band. For information and support on domestic abuse women can call the Frefo National Domestic Abuse Helpline on 0808. 2000-247 while men can call the men's advice line on 0808-8010-327.